It's WMS Warrior Morning News, live from our Library and Media Center studios. Good morning, Wilbur's Middle. Today is Monday, March 13th, 2017, and it is an A day. Please stand for the Pledge to our flag. One, two, three, and five. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Attention Drama Club. Attention Drama Club. The next rehearsal for Group A has been moved to Thursday, March 16th, due to the half day tomorrow. Attention Drama Club. The next rehearsal for Group A has been moved to Thursday, March 16th, due to the half day tomorrow. All Group A members and stage crew should attend this rehearsal. If there are any questions or concerns, you may. You must see Mr. O'Connor or Ms. Liestro ASAP. Attention chorus members, there is an after school rehearsal today in the auditorium for all 6th, 7th, and 8th grade chorus members. There will be a tone chime ensemble rehearsal Wednesday morning at 7.40 in the music room. Attention all students, this is the last week for our Pastas for Pennies collection. <laughs> Pasta for Pennies is a competition within your homeroom to see who can collect the most money to benefit the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society. Bring in your loose change and put it in the box on your homeroom teacher's desk. The winning homeroom will win a free lunch from Olive Garden, salad, breadsticks, and pasta. Homeroom 18 is still in the lead with $183.20. Thank you to all who have donated already. The WMS boys bowling team went through the playoffs in grand fashion with a three-point sweep against Forts on Thursday and another dominating three-point sweep against Colonia on Friday to claim the school's very first middle school bowling championship. Thanks to these high scores over those two days, it brought the title home. Michael Nitz with 133, Matt Modoni with a 150, Adrian Nevetto with a 155, Eric Dominguez with a 166 and a 181, Jared Seniak with a 156 and a 182, and Tyler Moore with a 193 and two 195s. Congrats again to the WMS Boys Bowling Team for accomplishing history. You have made your coach and your school proud. March is music in our school's month. Did you know if you stretch out the tubing in a trumpet, it would be six and a half feet long? Now, a special announcement from Dr. Crow. All right, all right. Hello, hello. What are these? We'll get these. What? All right. Hello? Hello? Is this thing on? All right. Now we have a lot to talk about, but I'll try to make it fast. Bowling. Holy cow. The girls had a wonderful season. Congratulations, girls. Boys, I can't believe what you did. Now, I didn't let you in on this on Thursday because I didn't want anyone to worry, but I forgot to wear my lucky jacket. So you won on Thursday. And then I didn't know what to do because you won. If I wore the jacket, could that bring you bad luck? I didn't wear it. You came flying through. I was so proud of you. Champions, way to go. We have a lot more to celebrate this week. Uh, this Wednesday, we will be celebrating two of our teammates, the Teacher of the Year, Mrs. Diamond. <laughs> hey, you, third row, pay attention. Uh, support Person of the Year, Ms. Palkowitz. All right, now, oh, just an aside, Seton Hall made it to the big dance, go and dancing. All right, uh, that means Seton Hall is going to the NCAA tournament. Uh, referendum tomorrow, remember to remind your parents there's a referendum tomorrow. Oh, and a weather report, snow! Have a great day. I am Dr. Crow, and I am so out of here.